I remember walking into mom's room and um, her and Dana were having to get funeral arrangements um, made and this was the conversation I'm walking into and I, I just said to Jesus, Jesus, I can't go here. But then, then we got worse news as the day kept going. And I knew uh, dad was saying, I think the doctors were saying, basically we were down to the final 24 hours. It felt like the shift had happened and it was starting to be dumb to believe. It was starting to be the wrong thing to believe. It, you know what I mean? With all the facts, all the things they're telling you. I'm so grateful for everything that every doctor did. And when the doctors say we did nothing, I know that they're saying they didn't change anything, but they had done so much. I'm so grateful for every nurse, every hospital worker that did so much. But we got to a moment where we had seen what man could do. And now it was time to see what God could do. And I just remember texting my nearest and dearest friends and um, just saying, okay, guys, we have to see a miracle in the next 24 hours. And I said, game on. I know my Jesus who turns these stories on ahead. Can you believe with me? That night when we were praying was probably the most unction I had felt in the whole time. As I heard my family praying with faith for my life and believing, every night renewed my confidence. I you are the God who heals. We ask, would you raise him up? You pour out more healing. Send help from all Jesus, I pray that you would heal coffee. I thank you for being his song in the night. I pray for supernatural comfort. Yes, ask you to receive it and make it strong. Would you do a miracle?